Hello all, uh, welcome to Ekas Cloud. I am Huzefa. Today we will understand, not only understand, we will do something here. See, this is a new uh, series in our uh, channel to give some. See, we have a lot of videos in our YouTube channel, like around we have 4000 videos, right? So uh, we are we are adding more videos usually we trainers will do less videos rather than students because our students will do more videos and that's our speciality as of now we have all the videos like uh, AWS videos networking videos server videos in many different languages and today we, from today we start a project videos this means which means if you watch this video no you definitely you can do something with this you definitely you can get a hands on experience i mean if you practice this and we will show you how step by step what you will do what is the first step what is the second step and we you will see the architecture i'll explain you the architecture i'll explain you what what the purpose of each service because we are starting a new series called projects AWS simple projects see we we start with the simple then we make it very big right so let us start without wasting any time we have a uh, one topic called host a static website how to build a static website using amplify we need amplify say I have a choice where I can use amplify click upload some uh, something there then I can show you as a website that's fine but I want to do as a project which means uh, where project means it could be uh, so many services should be involved right so many components will be involved right that then only it will it will be known as project it could not be a real-time project it could be a simple project only but this can be used in real time that's what I'm trying to say here so what I'm going to show you now in this session in this video you will understand how to build a project sorry how to build a static website using amplify that amplify will be integrated with a github this github will this github repository and created and uploaded by the Linux VM whatever static site you build in Amplify now that will be accessed from the internet users in in this video your character is the internet user your character is internet user it means you have to seem like an internet user and my character is the I am the creator of this. Um, shall we proceed? Yeah, let's get started. So before uh, we have to know each component, what the components are in involved here. So you can see we have to have one installed Ubuntu Linux computer locally, which means uh, I have this computer. If you can see here, uh, this is my computer. Uh, this is my computer, which I have <coughs> locally. This is my computer. I have Linux OS. Next, uh, I need to have Amplify in AWS, which means I'm going to use Amplify service. What is Amplify service? Amplify is a service which allows a fully managed by AWS. It's a fully managed service hosting for a static web apps, static websites. If you want to host a web app if you want to host a website which the backend structure will be managed by AWS then so website means you need to upload you need to keep all the components in this amplify right so you have two choice number one where you can upload all the components from the local computer to amplify or or you can upload sorry sorry you can directly integrate amplify with the 
github so what I'm going to do in this session I'm not going to upload manually I will integrate this amplify with the github repository that github repository we have github repository we uh, will upload uh, all the files to github repository from that github repository will be integrated to amplify amplify will host a, a website that website can be accessed from the internet this is what we are going to uh, do in this video if you are known to github that's fine if you are don't know here is a small definition to say what is github github is a provider for internet hosting for a software development and version control by using git software we have so many videos which is done by our previous students and other trainers of what is github what is git you can watch that videos also it offers a distribution distributed version control and source code management functionality of a git let's get started so to do this we have to use these commands I'm going to use these commands I'm going to use these commands to do this maybe you are thinking that uh, uh, if you want to note down this command you can note down if you have a time if you have or or I will give one choice in this video description you will be having a one telegram group that is ECAS cloud telegram group you can join in the group to get this notes in the group if you want this notes the document which I have showing in this you can directly you can come to the group and there you can get this document uh, that document will be available for free you can get it you can use this document as a reference to practice and also you can come there in the telegram group I will be there and like me our other trainers will be there and you join there and you can ask queries related to AWS whatever cloud technology queries we are help we are there to help you if you are if you have any questions if you have any problems in a your technology so that's all the introduction of this uh, uh, topic let's start one by one so what I will do I will go to Ubuntu Linux I will prepare one local uh, hosting site by using few commands there is some commands where I have to go and build that uh, site so here is my um, local uh, computer this is my Ubuntu uh, Ubuntu client usually uh, username is my my name Josefa alone is my computer name and I use some command to here to install the amplify uh, uh, sample web page npx create react app I'm going to create a application uh, application in a folder called amplify <coughs> amplify app so this is a command this command will create of a, a, a small application in my local computer it takes few minutes to create uh, let it go yeah it's it is installing it is creating in your case if you are using the same Ubuntu you can use the same Ubuntu uh, you can use the same commands to run it is uh, downloading so many files So just now this uh, installation done now it is ready uh, it's saying that uh, npm start uh, some npm test npm run eject there are a lot of uh, tools and commands are given uh, it's uh, no problem let's uh, connect what I have to do if I say ls I can see one folder called amplify app which is created just before 
I I will I will be entering into amplify amp folder and I will use one command npm start. When I enter this, what happens? It will trigger the site and there will be one super web page will appear. Yeah, this is a web page. See this web page. What you are looking blank, right? Just wait. It will load. See this is a web page. It's a one Node.js logo is going right. So this is web page. What I want is now it's it's it is working locally, local host. No, I don't want to run this. I want to I want to <coughs> bring this uh, whole project to uh, GitHub. From GitHub, I will integrate to Amplify. Let's do it. We go to GitHub. We have already opened GitHub. We have a uh, account in GitHub. We create a repository here. The one repository is I used to say AWS project. AWS project. Yeah, this repository is available. I make it. I'll made it public, and uh, it's optional to give readme file or whatever license. I just leave and create a repository. Once I create the repository, I will copy this the link the path of this once I copy I will go to the folder I'll just press Q sorry it's not working and now I will go inside the folder I have to push the whole uh, content which is there inside this amplify folder will be up uploading into github so there is a command here to uh, push all the files and folders to the github repository I will go git in it if if the git is not working you have to install git software and download it that is separate one I'm not teaching anything to install git you can watch some other videos how to install git it's it is just like uh, installing VLC media player I will initialize a git first command and say I will add a git repository by using command called remote uh, git remote add origin origin I will paste the copied path enter yeah it's uh, added now what I will do I will say git add space dot and uh, I will adding into git space and git commit I will give the first commit I say first commit and no branch no working tree is clean and the git push origin master it is showing something origin I think it's a spelling mistake just a minute sorry yeah it is asking the username <coughs> oh sorry uh, I have to use a different username I will use the username and once I log in, I'll just pause the video and type the username and password to log in. And then we'll see. Now you can see here is uh, I have logged in. Mm, I can counting objects, 100%, 22 objects, all the data which is there in my local folder, which is jumped into a GitHub repository, which I wanted to show here. I'll go back to the repository where you can see here in a project and you can see the public SRC folder source folder all these files came here and now what is the next step the next step is if you look at the architecture of the topology we have we created what we did we created a application on with files and we uploaded all this into the github repository by using git command once that uploaded what I will do I will go to AWS I will take uh, amplify I will go and create one amplify web app and I will integrate with amplify with github so that all the data will be will be present from the github usually this is what happens in a real time right uh, companies a company will have sorry sorry in company so many developers will sitting as a development team where the developers will put all the code into the github or gitlab 
that github and this is a source code management from there only all the uh, codes will be taken for production servers for any database servers, for any service which is running in anywhere it doesn't matter where you are I, I followed the same trick here because project means it should be a, at least something you have to involve so many components right I I had a cho I have a choice to where I can upload uh, uh, files directly to the Amplify. Let me show you how to go and upload or how to integrate uh, all these files in from GitHub. Let's move on to the AWS console. I have already opened this AWS console. I can go here. I can d I can see here in the light side front end web and mobile. In there I have Amplify. I've clicked it's opening amplify fastest easiest way to develop mobile and web app that scale if I go down where you can see host your web app or you can start building your backend you can building the backend authentication storage capabilities and so many in some other project we will see how to develop the backend uh, let's today we will because we have already one site package we go with the get started in get started you can see here deploy without git provider there I can uh, drop and drag files I can go and select the folder where I have all the files but I'm not doing it why because why because I'm not uploading manually I'm just integrating github and let's click continue in this in this github is already authorized because i have already logged in i have given all this so here is my showing the project and it's showing the branch i have only one branch in the github if you don't know what is git github and branches you have to see some other videos because this is not the video to teach what is branch what is git what is github it is just an overview uh, let's move on to the next uh, step uh, what happens now amplify will talk to this uh, here nothing to change because amplify will build deploy everything automatically let's say one deploy now you can see amplify will go and collect all the data and try to build a website this will be known as a static website so if you can see here it's a provisioning and uh, it will build deploy and verify it gives a URL you can use this URL to get the page whatever the page we have seen locally this is what we have to wait I will pause the video for uh, two to three minutes so that it takes two to three minutes to build everything and we'll see yeah it is uh, finished so now I will be able to see the result if I click here now if I click here I can see the result this is a web page uh, which is running from directly uh, from Amplify this Amplify page is coming from the github from that github is uh, loaded from the my local VM or any physical machine so uh, this is what the project it is it is not like a very big project where you can learn everything in a one uh, project uh, we it's a just a number one project only it's not a number hundred or some 50 project so from today I mean uh, so whenever I get a free time now I will do to I will try to do more projects I will do projects in AWS I will do projects in uh, Azure and in fact GCP also hopefully you enjoyed the feed in you enjoyed this video and thank you you can watch our previous videos uh, other videos project videos and thank you once again we'll see you next project bye